So welcome back to more Assassin's Creed 3. Let's keep it going. Go. Gentlemen, I believe I found the solution to our problem. Or rather, Odysseus has. Oh, do you? Are you a new guy? The Greek hero, you lobcock. Allow me to explain. We enter Silas' fort under the pretext of kinship. Once inside, we spring our trap, free the captives, and kill the slaver. <laughs> dodgy, dodgy. I like it. Then, let us begin. First, we need to find ourselves a convoy. Convoy should be here soon. We'll attack on my signal. Understood, sir. If we time this right, we can catch them all unawares. I'm trying to pick it up, it's not working. Go. There we go. That's her up. Charles, you and Williams serve as vanguard. Let no man reach us. What about me? You and John will follow from a distance and keep watch over us. I'll signal you when I have need of your services. We're here to help you, along with those held inside Southgate Fort. Free me. Not until we're inside the gate. I can't chance an inspection of the gate going wrong. I'll see you safe. You have my word. Do you know anything of Silas' operation? How many men we might expect? The nature of their defenses? You must be rather important to him if you were given your own escort. enemies ahead. Shall I engage them? No. Let Jonathan and Thomas take care of it. As you wish. I wish you'd trust us. Though I suppose it's oh, only to be wary. So be it. Take him out. God damn it, ducks. Let no man reach us. Yeah. 
He just disappeared. Ubisoft, what are you? Your hands weren't behind your back earlier. Mmm, them bugs. Aha. On your guard, then. Of course. Only say the word, and I'll cut them down. I also don't see how murdering everybody in front of the camp helps us get into the camp. Under the disguise. Wow! Such polish. But so far, I like this game a lot better than any of the other oh. ones. Evening, gentlemen. Even if it does Stay take forever Delivery. to get Science. to Connor. Go on. I understand the need for exposition, but still. See, I'm freeing you just as I said I would. Now, if you'll allow me to explain. Let her go. We should give us away. No, she won't. What's the plan? Free the captives and avoid detection. What of Silas? He dies. They know when you're ready to strike. Like I said, they had some nice tasting coats back then. Oh, get fucked. No, get down! What are you doing, Hathen? Who have we got there? What are you talking about? Prisoners. Stop slide change soldiers. Prisoners? I said oh boy. I'm gonna let him do his thing. Get up the rock. You're free as well. Come in the other way. Grab this dude real quick. Get fucked. Everybody should be free now. An hour of quiet was all I asked. 
Instead, I'm awakened not ten minutes later by this cacophonous madness. I expect an explanation, and it had best be good! How? How did this happen? My precious merchandise set free! It's unacceptable! Rest assured, I'll have the heads of those responsible. But first, first we clean up this mess! Seal the port, kill any who try to escape. I don't care if they be one of us or one of them. To approach the gate is to be made a corpse. Am I understood? I know you didn't. Man, I'm really good at this. Oh! Counter like, man, what? How did those guys hit me from there? I didn't get the prompt until just now. Come on, there was nobody around, really? <laughs> Gotta move. This is so stupid. Like, I, I blocked the stupid thing. What are you doing? Really? What happens now? We wait. And not for very long, I suspect. Good enough for me. It's been several weeks now since we freed the Mohawk prisoners from captivity. I had hoped their leader might make contact, but there's been only silence. My men grow restless. They want to know what comes next, and I do not have an answer. Lee alone remains active, pursuing leads however slight. He stalks the city streets and scouts the bordering woods, hopeful that he might make contact with one of those we saved. There was a woman there that night. It was she who helped the others to safety. If we can find her, I believe I'll have my answers. So, I watch and wait, hopeful that my true mission might finally begin.
All right. Hello, Charles. Any luck finding our mystery woman? Word is she's been stirring up trouble just outside the city in a town called Lexington. Well, then that's where we begin our search. I'll meet you there. Alright, so if I remember right, it takes ages to get to her, so I will catch you in just a minute. Alright, here we are. Have you found her? Uh, she's made camp not too far from here. Excellent. Well, the sooner we're done, the sooner we can get out of this cold. I'm afraid I have some bad news, sir. Oh? Braddock is insisting I return to service under him. I've tried to beg off to no avail. No doubt he's still angry about losing Pitcairn. To say nothing of the shaming we gave him. Do as he asks. In the meantime, I'll work on having you released. I'm sorry for the trouble. Not your fault. Quiet, quiet. Move, Charles. We're too late. Fire's only just been snuffed. Snow recently disturbed. She's close. Bollocks. Tracks are fresh. It must be hers. Mm. Seems she took to higher ground. Out of the snow and into the trees. Well, those are our tracks here. So she went this way. Why, did, why would she zigzag like this, though? Doesn't make much sense. Charles, before he grows suspicious. I can handle things from here. But, sir! But nothing! Go! Stop running! I only wish to talk! <laughs> I am not your enemy! Please just hear me out! Oh, I could just... God's woman! Only let me speak! Enough with these games! Wonderful. Woman. 
Get back here. <laughs> I can't do that. Are you touched in the head? Me? Haytham. I come in peace. Why are you speaking so slow? <sighs> Sorry. What do you want? Me, Haytham. Well, your name, for one. I'm Gadzi Zio. Well, pleased to meet you. God, God's day. Just call me Zio. Dio. Zio. Zio. Now tell me why it is you're here. Where did you get this? From an old friend. I've only seen such markings in one other place. Where? Well, it is forbidden for me to speak of it. I saved your people. Does this mean nothing to you? Look, I am not the enemy. Close to here, there is a hill. Meet me there, and we'll see if you speak the truth. That town hosts soldiers who seek to drive my people from these lands. They're led by a man known as the Bulldog. Edward Braddock. You know him? He is no friend of mine. Every day, more of my people are lost to men like him. Then I suggest we put a stop to it. Together. What do you propose? That we kill Edward Braddock. But first, we have to find him. Alright, let's go. I don't trust you. I know. Yet you remain. That I might prove you wrong. It will not happen. So you say. So I know. Yet, I remain. All right. Wait here. A Mohawkman is likely to raise suspicions, if not muskets. This is hardly the first time I've been amongst your people. I can handle myself. I okay. Hope so. You're the stand being quartered there. The endless crashing of the waves, the sting of the salt in the eyes, and the goddamn gulls shrieking and shitting everywhere. You're sure that's where we're going? Aye. The bulldogs putting together another expedition. That's what they're calling them now. Expeditions. Aye. Smart too. Slap a fancy name on something, and all evil is excused. Oh, come on! All I did was walk by. That's so stupid. Fucking Christ. Positions. Wonder what Braddock intends to do about it. He's already left for the advance camp. I'll wager our little holiday here is just about ended. We'll be marching south before weeks end. <laughs> you can't stand being quartered there. The endless crashing <sighs> of the waves, the sting of the salt in the eyes. And the goddamn gulls shrieking and shitting everywhere. You're sure that's where we're going? Aye. The Bulldogs putting together another expedition. That's what they're calling them now. Expeditions. Aye. Smart too. Slap a fancy name on something and all evil is excused. Think we're good to go? Oi! Where are you going, Cully? Me? No. The other cock robin. 
Well, I, uh, I was leaving. Oh? And now? Well, now... I'm going to feed you your teeth. And you were worried I was going to be the problem? <laughs> Can't see the action. I can't see. Jesus, I'm going to work, man. Braddock's camp when you're ready. It's gonna take me six million years to get there, but I'll catch you when I'm there. All right, here we are. Use the snowstorm to mask your approach. Having second thoughts? Hardly. But I'll have to approach this carefully. Go on then. I'll keep watch from here. Hmm. I can hide in that cart. If I can get to it. Blankets, a cart feed for the horses. What else? That's it. That's all there is. Oh, the irony. Where am I? I can't even see myself in here. Yeah, I don't know where I am. I think that's me under Those there. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Perhaps I could sabotage them. I think I just disappeared, to be honest with you. to retreat would only delay an inevitable conflict one in which they now have the upper hand there's merit to those words as much as i hate to admit it still can't he see this is unwise it doesn't sit well with me either we're far from home with our forces divided worse i fear braddock's bloodlust makes him careless it puts the men at risk i'd rather not be delivering grim news to mothers and widows because the bulldog wants to prove a point where is the general now? Rallying the troops. And then it's on to Fort Duquesne, I assume? Eventually. The march north will surely take time. There's a copy of the plans in the command tent should you wish to review them. At least this will be ended soon. I tried, John. I know, my friend. 
I know. That map will surely be of use. I need to find it. Got it. Let's go. Didn't see a thing. Stop. Gonna run for it. Alright, fuck it. Wanna go? Let's go. Yeet. The first time I did this mission, by the way, like when I was recording it, I play I uh I killed George Washington because he's in there. I didn't know it was George Washington. I just thought it was a dude. No need. We will ambush him here near the river. Go and gather your allies. I will do the same. I will send word when it is time to strike. I gotta go back all right with that i want to thank you guys for watching remember to leave a like if you enjoyed subscribe if you want to see more share this video around share with your friends share with other youtubers i don't care guys do what you can do to help me out we'll catch you in the next part later on